All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Cult of the Lamb. So, uh, just outside of recording, I did a couple of things. One of them was go around and uh, organize a little bit and clear out, uh, clear out some of the stuff around. And uh, Tyler gave me another quest, and that was to plant, which I did up here. I did some planting. Uh, other than that, that's kind of that's kind of all we've done. Oh, and then I moved the temple kind of like down this way. So let's see. We can do a sermon. And a ritual. I don't think we can do a ritual yet because we need the bones from our crusade. But we can at least do a sermon. And then we'll go on a crusade. Oh, we got a full 11. Curse of the Horde. Hearts of the Faithful. Bane Weapon. So I think we did this one last time. Might of the Devout. Increases the starting level of weapons when you begin. Hmm. That's a good one. Okay. Thanks, everybody. Now we must crusade. Uh, let's have... Okay, so Tyler's chopping... Hey, what's going on with you guys? Come back to work. You know what? Hold on. Garney, make demands. Go to sleep. Find a meal. Well, they get... Wait, you know what? Hold on a second. You go chop some trees. Speak to Pixie. Check this out. I also remember this, Sue. So I can give a gift of this necklace. Give to a follower to increase their loyalty. There you go, Pixie. Collect another a farming bundle. Farmer station allows followers to water nearby crops. Put seeds here for your followers to sow. Oh, that's not too shabby at all. And then over here is the body pit. We're gonna hold off on that. We're gonna do the farming bundle. Unlock the next tier. Colt level two. Ah, but we need another divine, so we'll come back to that. Uh, so we've got the beds, we've got that, and then down here. Oh, we need a farmer station. We need 20 gold. We gotta go on crusades. Alright, you guys do your thing. We're going on a crusade. We gotta do this one, I think, two more times. Yep. The dark wood. So we should get an upgraded weapon as well. Starting out. Ooh. A trader's razor for fast blade designed for many cuts. Low damage, but lightning quick. Hold to no, we're doing this one. Yes. We can take both? Wow, okay. All right, we gotta collect bones. Whoa. Oh, gosh. To do my eye. So it is true, the red crown sits upon the brow of another. But how? We did everything we could to. It matters not. We need to not bother Shimura with this. Deal with the brother, as you command my sister. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, Oh, I did not know that what that did. about this 
thing being low damage. Whoa, whoa. Oh yeah, that one was a good one. Whoa. Oh my gosh, how many more of you? Nice. So in order for us to get bones, we gotta chop up skeletons, by the way. Once we knock them out of their body, we have to chop the skeletons. That's how we get the bones. And we've already got our 25. So we can go down or right. Let's try going down. Well, that did no damage since it was on the ground. I like how even though we've done this section already a few times it's different ah draw a new tarot card 10% chance of gaining a blue heart when killing an enemy or gain an extra half a heart we're gonna do that okay thank you I appreciate it my half a heart that just got. That's a good goal. I need that. Oh, okay, so we're here. What's this? Wired gay flooring. Oh, it's a path. Okay. Very nice, very nice. We missed a spot. I don't know, like, is it worth going back, I wonder, and grabbing these? Like, these little spots that we miss? It's gotta be, right? the ritual now that we've got enough bones. Okay. Well, that's it. I guess we can go ahead to the, the final room here. Oops. That's the tarot guy. Okay. We can go for stone or we can go for a follower that leads up to whatever that is and then there. But if we go this way, we can go stone and then choose food. This is tough because we kind of need food right now, but we're going for the follower. Slash and hack all this grass real quick. Rescue. It's a cute little rabbit. Okay. Here we go. Well, that's the only place we can go is here. Still devotion. Bone still. 
got it. Oh, nice. I got a heart. left. Ouch. Nailed it. I don't know. These little razor dagger things are doing pretty decent. almost look like landmines. I was scared to step on them. Okay. A mighty tool of unstoppable brutality. So the speed, but the damage is up. Shoot a piercing bolt. I think we're going to do this one. Oh, that's our old one. Got it. Okay, so we need to go back and collect the room that we missed. Which is up here, right? Oh. Tarot card. Overall weapon damage increased by 1.2 or 10% of gaining. We're going to do the weapon damage. Fates have spoken. Okay. Your cards have been drawn. I'm going to assume that obviously when we get into other dungeons or crusades, or the maps are going to probably get much bigger than this. Possessions will follow you through death. Oh. Okay. Thanks. Are they trying to say that I was going to die in this next fight? Steel devotion. Thank you. Tarot card. There's another 10% chance or receive double the health when healing. We'll do this one now. <laughs> Got it. I don't know, I kind of like the bomb one better now that I have this one. If I'm being honest, the bomb did a lot of AoE damage. Right into that. Gosh, I'm taking a lot of unnecessary damage here. What is that? Okay. Shield of Faith. When attacked, 10% of the. Oh, 10% chance of negating damage. Okay, so it was like a free tarot card. Okay. those red X's on the ground. You don't want to step in those until the map is clear. Barbados? Wow, okay. Oh, I'm glad I was standing where I was at. Oh, 
build up some of this fervor so I can hit him like that. I missed every... Five stones or a blueprint. I'm gonna take the blueprint. Wooden planks, perfect for walking. Very nice. All right. Here we go. Oh, got a chest. Nice. There we go. Three of the four. mistake of becoming the servant of your followers. They are for you to use your to your advantage. Their faith is a resource. Spend it as you would gold, for you can always regain their trust with a well-placed gesture of kindness. Let it empower you. Let it give you license to do unspeakable things. Bend them to your will. I grant you the power to read their feeble little minds. Read mine. Follower, command, unlock. Interact with followers to read their thoughts as well as see how hungry, tired, or sick they are. Declare a new doctrine. You have selected... I don't know where I was reading that. You have declared a doctrine which has granted you a new follower action. When interacting with followers, this action will be able be available to you. Very nice. Now that's cool. I like how it puts my... Uh, my name across the title screen there. Thank you. Oh, they're all sleeping. Repair. Reassign Tyler. Oh, they're all hungry. Hey! Birds were eating my crops. I'm gonna plant some new berry seeds here. And you can add poop as fertilizer, by the way. Alright, so we gotta cook. Oh, there's only two. Some food out for now. Wow, we can collect another divine inspiration. Cult level two. Upgrade the temple and try and collect. Yes, we're gonna do this one. Unlock the whole level two now. Very nice, very nice. We also have two new followers. Cult upgraded. Day seven. Okay, we got the uh, the cute little bunny rabbit. Please spare me. Okay, so this one is gonna be. Uh, we're gonna name this one Rosa. Okay. 
choose variant. We'll give her a little comb over. There you go. Accept. Welcome, Rosa. Uh, you. Uh, go worship. Yeah, we've got this one. This one's very interesting. We're gonna name this one. Oh, this one's the Barbados. This one's gonna be Dark Ghost himself. Oh. Oh. You can go worship as well. So we gotta repair these beds. We also need more beds. Oh, is Thomas sick? Oh, it's because he needs he needs food. Is he gonna go eat now? Yeah, he's gonna go eat now. Good, he's gonna go eat. Okay, building. We can now build a seed silo, a farmer station. Yeah, we can have these guys uh, start watering. So the seed, we're gonna put this thing, we'll put this guy uh, right there. And then we also need to build some more beds as well. One, two, how many do we have? We have one, two, three, f one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we have seven followers, so perfect. Okay, I'll come over here and build these beds real quick. Oh. On a sign, or a sign. So we'll give this one to... Oh, did Rosa already can take that one? Oh, she did. Is Dark Ghost gonna take that one? Oh. Yep. Okay. Everyone's got a bed now. Perfect. Oh, we also need to come down here. Okay, what's going on up here? What is it? Oh. Oh, you guys are building that for me. I was like, what the heck? Here, I'll help. I didn't mean to speak to you. You guys have almost got it. Perfect. Oh, our bushes. Hey, we can pick the berries. Now we can start making some more food. What is that thing that just sprouted? Is that like a weed? That's exactly what it is. It's like a weed. Wow, these are kind of a pain to to get out. We also got to perform our ritual. So I think now that we have this, we're gonna plant that and water. Plant that and water. I wonder if there's a way to prevent the birds from coming and destroying our crops. See, cook. There's a couple of meals. All right, now we can come in here. Now we can perform our ritual. There we go. Our first ritual. I don't know what the point of doing that was, but... Oh, on cooldown. Okay. We can do a, another sermon. It's time, my followers. 
Oh, so you get one per person when it's on cooldown. A noble guard fit for the leader of a cult provides no bonuses. <laughs> nice. Okay, we're done. Back to work, everybody. Oh. Indoctrinating followers is well and good, but there is so much more you can take from them. Give them gifts, complete quests, and perform blessings for them, and you will increase their loyalty to you. Once they are total, totally loyal to you, they will give you everything they own. Watch as I show you. Follower, come back in here. Follower loyalty. Increase a follower's loyalty to level them up, and they will reward you with devotion and a commandment stone fragment. Each time a follower levels up, they will generate additional devotion when a sermon or a worshiping at the shrine, so be sure to cultivate their loyalty. To increase their loyalty, you can give a follower a blessing once a day uh, when you interact with them. You can also give them gifts, complete quests, perform sermons. The more loyal followers you have, the stronger you'll become. I have much to teach you, but I am old and grow weary. Visit me at my home, and I will show you how to harness the true power of the Red Crown. Oh, there's a map to this place? Lonely Shack? How do we visit the... Oh, okay. doing so can i have like pigs like like work worship 10 farms it says no tasks available mine chop trees worship yeah there's real there's no uh let's see read minds interact sleep eat or give a blessing Give each person a blessing. Give a blessing. Oh. <laughs> very nice, very nice. Guess I'll just kind of make my rounds and give everybody a blessing. <laughs> Get everybody's loyalty up a little bit here. <laughs> make sure everybody's happy. Very nice. Are we missing somebody? Wow, Tyler's loyalty is actually really high. It's probably because I've already done several quests with him. So can I do anything with Tyler? Sleep, eat, or give blessing. I've already given him the blessing for the day. Read his mind. Oh, these are his thoughts. Gotcha. Okay. All right. So it looks like we've got to give a gift, which I already did. I gave a gift to Pixie already. Yeah, I already gave her a gift, but it didn't count because it was part of the uh, this quest now. Ooh, we're getting close to that one. Give a gift, increase follower loyalty. And then collect reward from leveled up follower. Okay. Travel. We also can go to the guy's house now. Up here. I also saw something else on the map we can go to. What is this? There's a present. You have discovered my humble cottage. Be careful you don't make the same mistakes I did or you'll end up in a place just like this. <laughs> now, perhaps a game of knuckle bones? You don't know it? Why, it's simple. Step up to the table and I will show you. Play knuckle bones? But what about this present? Pick up. Fire big gift. Oh. Well, there's a gift I can give. Okay, knuckle bones. Difficulty? <laughs> I guess it's on easy right now. Knuckle Bones, a dice game of risk and reward. 
when dice of the same number are placed in the same column, multiply their value. Destroy the opponent. Destroy your opponent's dice by matching yours to theirs. Okay. So he rolls. So he rolled a five. I rolled a two. He rolled a four. I rolled a four. Ah, okay. He rolls a five. I rolled a three. Um. He rolled a three. I rolled a five. Can I put that there? Oh, yeah. There we go. Okay, he rolled a two. And I rolled a two. Use this to. I rolled a one. I rolled a five. And I rolled a four. Oh, each row. I get it. So he beat me on that one. I get it. Okay. Well, that's only going to give me a seven. So the middle one's locked in a 12. Ooh, we rolled a six. Yikes. choice but to go there. He rolled a one, okay. Oh boy. That's all I've got. Oh, Land wins. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but by the one below, you're a natural. Here, you've earned yourself a prize. Oh. Tarot card. Gain an extra heart. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. <laughs> now you've had a taste of the game and care to wager some coin? No, I'm good. Thanks, man. I'm just going to go back home and collect or give my gift. See, look, there's like other places to go. There's like a fishing dock or something down there as well. I am home. Nothing in the box. Fertilizer. I've only got one fertilizer left. Oh. Hey, uh, let's see. Work. Chop, mine, build, worship, ten farms. There's nothing to do. Okay, well, we can give a gift. I'm going to give a gift to Snapple now. There you go. Wow. Okay. Now we gotta increase followers' loyalty until they level up and then collect a reward, huh? Whoa. We can collect another divine inspiration. Oh boy. Okay. Lumberyard. A follower will generate wood. Follower will generate stone. Send your followers on holy quest to gather resources. That is, if they make it back alive. Oh gosh. That's kind of sketchy. Oh, so we gotta have that. So, um. Let's do this one. Follower will generate wood. Okay. Got it. So who's the highest? I think Tyler is the highest. Yeah, Tyler and Brianna are pretty close. On uh, how high they are on their loyalty level. So the food is also getting really low again. Um, faith. We've got decorations, which we'll worry about that later. A seed silo. Put seeds here for your followers to sow. So that might actually come in handy as well. It's 10 stone, 10 wood, and 20 coins. Lumber yard. Oh, we need more wood. I think we're going to have to go on a uh, on a crusade to 
uh, to gather some more stuff. But we'll save that for the next episode, and that should be our last crusade for the the Darkwood as well. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed some more Cult of Lamb. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one.